Race four in the card is a maiden plate over 1,400 meters. It's due for 10 minutes to two. It's the first leg of the pick six. And again, there is a bit of form to work on. Number six, Jay's Dancer, been knocking very loudly at the door for trainer Tenny Prince Lua. Lyle Hewitson rides on this occasion. Three-year-old son of Jay Pegg. His last three runs at Hollywood Bets Gravel have all been pretty good. He was beaten a whisker three runs back by Bless My Path, then third to the snow wall, and again beaten a whisker uh, by Avenir. But for the photograph, he may no longer have been in Maiden Company. But here he is and he has every chance of finally getting off the mark here. I say finally, he's only had seven starts. He's had two seconds, two thirds, two fourths. So he's certainly overdue his maiden victory. Number six, Jay's dance. So he just needs a little bit of luck and the photograph to go his way. What of the opposition? But heading the challenge, I suppose, would be number three, Red Rock Canyon. Dennis Dreyer's runner. Sean Veal takes the ride, Red Rock Canyon has the benefit again of a very good draw. Last time out, had every chance as well. He ran on third, he ran on steadily to be third behind Captain Sega, beaten three lengths. Again, that form has to, to stand up. It's still under scrutiny, but certainly in a field of this nature, number three, Red Rock Canyon, has done enough to be considered uh, for bipods, place accumulators, etc., and possibly even the pick six. He does have a chance of beating the luckless number six, Jay's Dancer, if things don't map out for Jay's Dancer as we expect them to. There's only one other runner with a serious claim to winning, and that's number eight, Lightning Spirit. Uh, there and thereabouts in its last two starts, second to Ulterior Motive, followed that up with a fourth place finish behind Academy Award, and certainly uh, Serena Moodley doing duty for the Allison Wright stable, uh, the son of Captain L. Uh, must go in to all permutations. I think you can narrow it down to those three runners. Six Jays Dancer, three Red Rock Canyon, and eight Lightning Spirit. I would be surprised if the winner came from any of the other runners. One absolutist, only its second start here, could improve, although I fancy we'll need more ground uh, in the future. And then on best past form, number nine, Sweet William, might be worth considering for the back end of Cortez. But here's hoping Jay's dancer finally gets a bit of luck.